Now, in order to find an equation for the circle, what we've got to do is remember the basic format of the equation of a circle. So you should know that the equation of a circle is essentially x minus x1 squared plus y minus y1 all squared equals r squared, where x1, y1 are the coordinates of the center of the circle. And we've already found that that center has coordinates 6 minus 1, so x1 is 6 and y1 is minus 1, and r is the radius. Now, we don't have the radius, but we can use AP to work out what that radius is. That's called it r. All right. So, how do we go about finding what r squared is? Well, that's very easy because all we need to do is essentially use Pythagoras' theorem. We can consider a right angle triangle like this, okay, and we'll put the right angle in there if you like. Pythagoras' theorem is essentially the hypotenuse squared, that's r squared, equals the sum of the squares of these two sides. So we start from that point then in this question that r squared is equal to this side squared. Now that length is going to be the difference in the x coordinates, so that's 6 minus 1, so 6 minus 1 all squared. You can see that length is 5, 5 units here, and we're going to square that. Plus this length squared, that's the difference in the y coordinates, so that's minus 1, minus, minus 2, so minus 1, minus, minus 2 all squared. So what have we got? Well, we've got 6 take 1, which is 5. That length is 5. 5 squared, 25. This length here, difference in the y coordinates, turns out to be 1 unit. And 1 unit squared is 1. So you've got basically that r squared equals 26. Obviously, if I wanted r, it would be the square root of 26. But looking up here, I want r squared, so might as well just leave it as 26. So therefore, we're in a position now to get the equation of the circle. So we just put, therefore, equation of circle, okay, is, right, using this form, we can just say it is x minus x, the x coordinate of the center of the circle, which is 6, all squared, plus y minus the y coordinate of the center of the circle, which is minus 1. So that's minus minus 1, so I can write that as plus 1, all squared, equals the radius squared, which we saw was 26. Okay, so that's the equation of the circle. And that brings us nicely now to the end of this question.